Hello, my friends. This is old Dr. Dog back again with some more good things about linear regression. In this video, we're going to examine the utilization of SPSS to conduct linear regression. Now, conducting linear regression with SPSS simply requires that you follow the menus and understand the important parts of the readout. Now, this video is going to carry you through the process of conducting simple linear regression on two variables. The next video will uh, review the readout for you, and then I think that will finish up our discussion of linear regression. In this, uh, in this uh, example that we're going to do using SPSS, I have uh, created a database for a uh, public two-year degree granting institution uh, in Texas and for 2011, and we will have two variables, the independent variable, which will be the total enrollment in the institution, and the dependent variable to be part-time enrollment. Our goal will be to develop a model by which we may enter the total enrollment of an institution and predict what the part-time enrollment of that institution will be. So let's get on with SPSS and see what it looks like. Well, here we are in SPSS, and you will notice that I've already gone into the variable view, set up two variables called total enrollment and part-time enrollment, and then I have copied those, uh, those data which I extracted from the iPads for the 63 institutions in the state of Texas. So what we're going to do is we're going to conduct a uh, simple linear regression to develop a model by which the total enrollment may predict the part-time enrollment. Once the data sets in place, we would go up and highlight analyze, and we read down through the things, general linear model. That sounds pretty good. Well, that's not it, though. Regression. Remember, you're not doing a general linear model. You're doing a regression. And what type of regression are we doing? We're doing a linear regression. I want you to notice you can do curvilinear regression if you choose to. Uh, all sorts of different things out there, but we're doing a linear regression. Now then, what again was our independent and our dependent variable? The total enrollment was our independent variable. We will put it here. The part-time enrollment was our dependent variable. Now, it asks for some statistics up here to see what we might want. Uh, regression coefficients, estimates, the model fit. Uh, the R, we want our descriptives, and we might want the R squared, okay? So let's, let's go on and see what this uh, looks like. And we will tell it now that we've entered that. Let's see what plots we might want. Oh, I don't think we'll do any of those right now. And we, but we can do plots of these two variables if we choose. Let's select OK. And let's see what comes back into our viewer. And I'll move it over in the screen capture so you can see it. We have regression. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and click on that in and, and enter something done by Dr. Dog. There we are. We got that down, hadn't we? Now it's in my, in my sheet. Just for, I did that for some of y'all that are doing projects in this to show you how to enter your group name. We have uh, descriptive statistics, correlations, variables. Uh, we have the model summary. We have an ANOVA. Here's what's important. We have the coefficients that we're looking for. So what we've done, my friends, is we have just done a regression analysis in SPSS. Our next video, we will examine the readout to understand what it says for us. This looks good. And by the way, I'm sitting up here in the camera on this one because one of my friends told me that I wasn't using the camera because I didn't know how. I just want to show you, Rick. I know what I'm doing. Have a good one. Well, my friends, you are making tracks through statistics. I will tell you what. You're just about to reach the halfway point. Uh, you've, uh, you've done an introduction. You've done correlation. You've done factor analysis. We're winding down linear regression. I mean, you are really moving, and it's been a good learning curve, but you're making tracks through the course. I want to thank you very much for your support. One more little video in linear regression where we examine the readout. Live long and prosper. This is the old dog signing off.